Yo guys, what is up? It is James. So first and foremost, I want to say that I am kind of sick. Uh, I've been coughing a lot and whatnot, so I do apologize if there are some cuts in this video. Um, I might have to make some cuts because I don't really want that getting in the recording. But today, we're going to be talking about the reshuffle update. And later on in this video, I will be playing uh, a snippet of another video that I took yesterday where basically one of my friends, James Icecaster, uh, brought to my attention that the reshuffle update um has now made it impossible to reshuffle discarded tc back into your hand now i'm going to go ahead and say if you are a big advocate on um max level pvp of which being like level 100 to 120 then this video is probably not going to apply to you but if you are someone that does like level 80 um you know like level 70 level 60 50 maybe 30 i'm not too sure then this video is probably mostly going to apply to you but basically um we all know king's isle you know we all know that king's isle likes to throw updates and curve balls at us and sometimes they aren't always obvious um but i think king's isle has taken a very huge blow with the reshuffle update not only making it so that you can't duplicate cards which isn't really a big problem to me because I've never had to, you know, use that kind of strategy or use that kind of method to win a game in a match. But it's just kind of weird that they would also implement without really seeing it because I didn't see this in the patch notes directly that when you discard a TC, you can't reshuffle it back into your hand. Now, when I was first told this by James Icecaster... By the way, shout out to him for actually noticing this because when I was doing PvP about like two weeks ago or even a week ago, I did not notice this at all. Uh, and he actually told me that uh, because they snuck this little feature in or disabled this feature rather, it actually ended up uh, resulting in him losing a match that he was supposed to win because he had discarded a TC for later and tried to reshuffle it back in his hand to get a kill or whatever the method that he was trying to go for, uh, it didn't work anymore because he couldn't reshuffle that TC back in his hand. So I'm going to go ahead and play the video that I took where basically I found out that you couldn't do this anymore. So I'm gonna go ahead and play that right now. So basically, as you can see, they removed this feature from the game. And again, I'm not too sure. I'm pretty sure they did not mention this in the patch notes. They only said that you couldn't duplicate cards when you enchanted them and whatnot. So obviously a huge blow at level 30, maybe level 50 PvP. Definitely level 50, maybe level 30. I should have said that instead. But um, it's definitely going to change the meta because i know for a fact that some people don't know about this because you know i for one did not know about this and i was just casually doing pvp and i didn't think too much of it i never really tried it um i could have sworn that i did reshuffle a tc in my hand but apparently you can't anymore and now that this is getting brought to the light uh, I kind of want to hear, you know, you guys' standpoint on it. You know, did you know that this was a thing? D you know, do you think that it's going to affect your play style now that you know that this is a thing? Um, and, and, you know, again, 
King Zhao has taken many shots at PvP, you know, with the critical system. They actually ended up did tweaking it. They, they did tweak it, but it, they didn't really, like, fix it, fix it, because you can still get crit on, and a move can still do mass, because um, even at level 50, you know, damages get as high as 70, 80, 90. You know, like, the best uh, ice damage with 50 resist right now is, like, 90 damage and 50 resist. So, if you get crit on... Uh, you know, especially because Grand's like the blade, and this guy is an ice. Um, you know that that Snow Angel or that Frostbite is doing like like one k or more a tick. So I want to go over exactly how this is going to affect the game and PvP because you know PvP basically is the only fun end game to Wizard 101, or at least favored by most players. But how is this going to affect PvP and you know players that utilize reshuffle? And players that utilize, you know, being able to draw TC, discard something that you might need after you reshuffle or that you don't need at the moment and wanting to reshuffle it back and not being able to because they've snuck this little disabled feature in. Well, I definitely think that Grandmaster PvP, um, you know, because they've taken many shots at, uh, at things that affect Grandmaster and Juju spammers. They said that they were going to fix Juju spamming, but the card I'm pretty sure is still like, what, three pips? So you can still spam it pretty effectively. They said that they were going to make it like five pips and have yet to do so. They even said this on KI Live, actually, to like 2,000 people. They said that they were going to make the card five pips to prevent people from complaining about Juju spamming. And instead they just implemented the reshuffle update, which to my understanding should have had a bigger impact on Juju spammers. But to my surprise, uh, it seems like it brought them back. Like if you've noticed lately, there have been a lot of like 2v2 Juju spammers, a Juju spammer and a legendary, um, just a Juju spammer doing, you know, uh, level 80 PVP. Um, I haven't really seen any max juju spammers because it doesn't really work anymore, but a lot of level 80 juju spammers have just been in queue. And for some reason, I guess they feel empowered to do it now. Um, whereas, you know, they could do it probably more effectively back then. I have no idea why, but it just seems to have brought them back. Um, even though they're at a disadvantage, they're still gaining, you know, massive rank and don't really seem to be affected uh, by the update, but this no TC recovery update is definitely something that I had to bring to people's eyes because This could end up affecting one of your matches and it's not like RNG, you know, since it is implemented um, You know, it, it's not a chance of like randomly happening. It's a thing like if you discard your TC you are not getting that TC back so uh, another thing to add on about the meta and how this will change PvP, if you didn't know that this happened, um, you know, it really discourages you from drawing from your side because you know that if you get, you know, your big hit that you don't want to use and it's clogging your hand, you kind of contemplate now on whether you want to discard that card or not because you know that if you discard it and you have reshuffles in, um, and or your strategy revolves around using reshuffle to get back TC or to get back your card so that you can still play the game if the match takes that long, then, you know, it really discourages you from drawing from your hand and possibly pulling that hit because if you discard it, you're not getting that move back. So, um, I'm not sure how people are going to adapt to this. I'm not sure if it's going to affect people's play style, but before it hits you hard in a match and you lose because you can't reshuffle you know, your hit back or that one clutch TC. Um, I guess this video is going to inform you that you can't do that anymore. And again, I'm not sure if this is something that is that has been known. I definitely did not know it. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and call it out as a bug because I'm pretty sure King Zhao did not intentionally mean to add or disable rather this feature in the game because um they only mentioned again in the patch notes that they were going to make duplicating cards um no longer a thing and now to find out that you can no longer reshuffle tc in your hand which has been around for a very 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 long time and you know isn't really an rng factor so i mean 
if you do end up wanting to reshuffle a card back in your hand, you had that option and that could have been a game winning factor. So to me, this isn't really a big surprise. I do think it's a bug and I do want Kings out to fix this because reshuffling TC has never been like a problem with players such as like, you know, angels in queue or juju spammers in queue or people critting on you. It was always a factor that played into your strategy of winning a match. And now to find out that, you know, you have to be more careful than before about pulling from your TC because you can now easily burn out your TC. Um, it's kind of scary. I mean, it doesn't even make you like it, it like it makes you discouraged now to pull from side unless you can assure a kill with what you might pull. So I'm not really sure what to say about this. Again, you guys saw the video at the beginning of this video. And yeah, I mean, I'm not sure if it's a bug. Um, I want to say it's a bug. Uh, and I hope that King's Isle, you know, gets this fixed. I hope that this video might bring some more attention to it and end up getting it fixed because, because I don't see a reason why you shouldn't be able to reshuffle a TC that you discarded out of your hand back into your deck. It doesn't really make any sense. And it might screw up some people that, you know, really relied on that or, you know, saw that as like, you know, the last option in a match to possibly bring it back. And... I think that this is yet another blow at PvP to try to make people discouraged uh, from doing it. I also think that if brought to Chaos attention, this is going to be one of those things that they just overlook again and take like years and years and years to respond to just like Critical. It took them months after months after months, like a year and a half after, you know, the subject got brought up. Actually, uh, a video was made. Uh, by someone's name I won't mention, but, you know, this video in question was made a long time ago. So the problem had been going on for a very, very long time, and it took years upon years for King Zhao to actually address the problem and slightly tweak it, not even fix it. Um, but we all know King Zhao, we all know how they are with things, you know, very, very sloppy company, um, definitely not, you know, a company that you want to have, you know, make your favorite game because if they do, they are just not going to listen to feedback and whatnot. This is one of those things that they just slipped in and I mean, I didn't really know until now. So I, I do apologize if this was a known thing. Um, it's just that to me, it was a big surprise because I could have sworn like I recorded an ice video uh, a while ago where I reshuffled and got my TC back. But to my surprise, I don't know if it was like, you know, fixed or something, but now you can't do it. I'm not sure if you can do it, um, you know, outside of the arena, but inside the arena, you can't do it anymore. But anyways, guys, if you did enjoy this video and agree with anything that I had to say in this video, then drop a like. If you guys like this sort of sit down and talk video style, then I might consider doing more of these videos in the future. But for right now, this is going to be James giving you all these sign out. I will see you guys next time. Peace.